So today I'm gonna to show you what I sold uh, today. I sold three items today so far. Um, I don't know what it is, but I get a lot of business from like the West Coast. So I'll go to bed tonight and probably wake up with a sale or two or at least some watches so I can send an offer to somebody on something that they're interested in buying. Um, but this is, uh, if you're gonna kind of do this as a hobby or even I guess as a business, um, I think I'm working my way towards that. Uh, it's all about numbers. So um, you either have to have a lot of numbers or very specific items that you know are selling and you can flip your inventory quick. There's a bunch of ways to do it. Um, but I actually just, I'm enjoying it as a hobby for now. I'm enjoying finding stuff and going out and looking and seeing what I can find, it just like I said, for myself or to make some money. Um, so that being said, I have about 836 items now or 35 items. Um, when I see people who do it like full time, they're usually uh, like 3000 items plus listed on eBay and they're flipping, you know, some people just flip t-shirts, some just flip whatever or um, a host of different items. I just like different items. I'll see something that's cool and I wanna learn more about it. And um, we get to learn about different things, uh, different things that are for sale, people want. So I find it interesting. Anyway, um, so here's three items I, I bought and sold, okay? And this is a New England Patriots do your job sweatshirt. Um, I got this, I think I got this at the bin for like, you know, $3. Um, but I got this like probably four months ago and these are goalie shorts. All right. I bought these at Bob's sporting goods or sports authority, uh, for, uh, $3 and 50 cents. I just sold these for like, I think it was 22, $23. Um, so I bought this a month ago and I got these shoes at the bins, uh, probably for $2, um, this week so uh it goes to show you that you get, you'll you sit on some items um longer than others some items will sell real, real quick i mean this lot that i got these shoes from there was a, sh a shirt in there and as i was listing that shirt and listing other items that shirt sold it sold in like eight minutes it was actually pretty cool so something i bought about three or four months ago something i bought over about a month ago and something i bought this week so it gives you an idea of the range and time frame you're going to sit on some items all right so also in this video we'll talk about the dollar tree uh, i go there a lot uh, my daughter loves going there so uh we go there a lot but i have flipped some items there uh, i've also got burned from the dollar tree you get cheap crap there you just gotta be careful what you buy and what you sell you will get you what you pay for it when people give you a, uh, some feedback it could be negative feedback uh, some guy gave me negative feedback because the and it was was a piece of crap and I ended up giving him his money back because I felt bad and I ended up taking the listings down I actually kind of felt like I shouldn't have put those listings up anyway um, but here was something interesting doggy pads so these were $1.25 because now the $1.25 store it's not the dollar store anymore but these doggy pads I got for $1.25 each I bought I bought uh, like a box of these XLs and a box of the largest. And there's way, different ways to do it. So I went on, uh, I was like, oh, that might be a good flip. Because um, it's light. It fits in an envelope easily. It's cheap to ship. Um, shipping on this is probably going to be like $4. Um, so you can either sell for $11 free shipping and you'll make 5 bucks. Or um, I saw some listings on eBay, uh, shipping was $4, but people had it listed for about $11. Or you can sell, you know, a bundle, you can bundle it up, make a lot of like three, you know, and sell, you know, say this is 375, try to multiply it by five, and, uh, you know, try, try to get 20 bucks for the three of them, or even 15, if you get 15 for the three, that's not a bad, it's still not a bad flip, you made over $10 with the fees. Uh, after the fees and stuff. So Dollar Tree, uh, you can get lucky there. I've sold some things there. I've also got burned, but this is my uh, newest flip from the Dollar Tree. I haven't listed them yet. I'm gonna list them, try to figure out. I might do a couple of things. I might do a bundle of three, a bundle of five, and then like individuals and see how they sell and take note of that um, so I can carry that information forward as I grow. So that's that's it.